Thank you, colleagues. Uh, I, too, am also rising in opposition to House Bill 4228, the Education Omnibus Budget Bill before us. Um, you know, a budget is a blueprint of our state's priorities. This one, unfortunately, represents a disinvestment in our schools and a disinvestment in our children. It contains many of the same flaws I pointed out during our debate on these individual bills in the Senate, and it continues many of the same misguided policies that my colleagues and I have railed against year after year. While this school funding budget does not contain significant per pupil cuts to our public schools this year, it also does not contain a funding increase that comes anywhere near close to counteracting the near, nearly $2 billion that has been cut by our, our public schools uh, the last three years. This budget also continues to ignore our state constitution and the will of the people who passed Proposal A by taking $400 million from the school aid fund this year alone to fund community colleges and higher education budgets. And despite this blatant shell game with education funding, our public universities and community colleges have not been, whole, been made whole either and have been cut upwards to 15 percent in recent years. Yes, a budget is a blueprint of our state's priorities. Let's not sell out our kids or our state's future. We need to go back to the drawing board, respectfully request that people vote no on House Bill 4228, and I ask that my remarks be printed in the journal.